Okay, a uh, couple of uh, tricks that uh, are useful when using Advanced MD when you're using the electronic health record. So these are just a few. I uh, picked two or three uh, to show everybody because it may not be obvious to everyone. These are some basic computer uh, techniques, tricks that don't just uh, work solely in Advanced MD, that work with all uh, Windows-based computers, but you may or may not be aware of them, particularly if you're not used to using laptops. Uh, so first trick, number one, how to change the size of your text. So you may notice, I'm going to come over here and pick one of the test patients. Let's do test dummy. So open test dummy. You may notice that sometimes, yes, yes, a little reminder here, that there are things that are cut off over here on the side or that you can't see for some reason, or maybe it's just hard to read, like when you're going to a chart note and it's just hard to see, see your text. So let me open one up. Um, for example, these are medications, nutrition referral. Let's see what that looks like. So, of course, you can change the size of the text here when it's a, a document by using the plus minus function here. I think everybody knows that. But there's another trick that I use, which is when the cursor is sort of hovering here. Let's say I want all of this text here to look bigger. It's harder to see. Or I want it smaller because it's hard to read all the information in there. Well, there's a trick to use on your scroll pad. If you use your two fingers and you scroll outward, you make the text bigger. So I'll do that as it's going outward to show you what happens. So you see it's making my text bigger down here. Let me go to a chart note to show this. PM160. Refusal to vaccinate. These are all prescriptions. Boy, Sarah, you've been doing a lot of practice. We're all Sarah in here. Ferencol. Oh, there's some Dr. Lipson. A lot of Dr. Lipson. You've been doing some practice too. Oh, consent. Old chart item. Nope. I just want a chart note. Let me go to notes. That's where I should do. I'm wasting my time here. Sorry, guys. Let me get a chart note. That's all I care about is an old chart note. PM160. No, not that one that we generate. Oh, chart items. Sick visit. There we go. Let's go to that sick visit up there. That'll work the best, I think. There's one done by Dr. Lipson in May. Let's pull open his sick visit. Make this bigger. Okay, so again, let's say we're looking at the sick visit, and I don't like how small this type is. Well, if I want to make it bigger, again, I'm going to go two fingers down, spread apart, and it makes the screen bigger, and I'll show you. Two fingers down, spread apart. Oop, let me get that in the center again. Two fingers down, spread apart. So you get a little bigger. Two fingers down. Oop, sorry. Two fingers down, spread apart. Two fingers down. Spread apart, there it gets bigger, so you notice the font getting bigger and bigger. Two fingers down, spread apart. See how the font's getting bigger. Now when it gets so big, you start to see it overlap. So, so in some cases, you'll see a, a chart note that looks like this, and you can't really read it because all the words overlap one another because the font is too big. And so when you see that, you basically do the opposite. And you put two fingers wide apart and you squeeze them together like this. And I'll show you. I'm going to do that exact thing. Two fingers wide apart, squeeze them together. Two fingers apart, squeeze them together. Two fingers apart, squeeze them together. See how it's getting smaller and smaller. Two fingers apart, squeeze them together. Smaller and smaller. I'll just make it ridiculously small to prove the point. Two fingers apart, squeeze them together. Two fingers apart. Again, I'll show you. This is to make it smaller, two fingers apart, squeeze them together. So if you have an iPhone or an iPad, it works the exact same way. See how tiny all that's gotten? Now do the opposite to make it bigger. 
put them close together and spread them apart. S closer together, spread them apart. Closer together, spread them apart. Makes it bigger. Closer together, spread them apart. So that's the uh, first tip. Uh, check out the other videos to see the other tips. Thank you.